In this quick lesson, I'll show you how to calculate dosage using Young's rule. Question one reads, calculate the correct dosage of a medicine for an 11 year old girl weighing 70 pounds and whose accepted adult dosage is 500 milligrams. Before we begin, let's start with a quick definition. The Young's rule formula is used to calculate the equivalent dose for children older than one year. So this cannot be applied for any infant that's less than 12 months. In addition, the formula works by putting the age in years. So if you're given an age that's, let's say, 18 months, which is a year and six months, you have to convert that into a decimal number. And I'll show you an example of that at the very end. So with that being said, let me show you how to apply this formula. We're told that this girl is 11 years old, so her age is 11, and the adult dosage is 500 milligrams. And I'll represent that as AD is 500 mg. Let's apply those numbers into this formula. So we have the child's dose, CD, is equal to 500 times, and over here, you'll take the number 11, and you'll divide it by 11 plus 12. That's equal to 23. Using our calculator, we'll take 500 and multiply that by 11 divided by 23. We end up with 239, and rounded up, 240 milligrams. So the equivalent dosage for this 11-year-old girl is 240 milligrams. Let's try one more example. A two-year-old needs amoxicillin. The normal adult dose is 250 milligrams. Using Young's rule, what is the appropriate dose? So, using the formula, we'll write down CD is equal to 250 multiplied to the age, which is 2, over 2 plus 12, that's 14. Let's use our calculator really quickly. We have 250 times 2 divided by 14 gives us approximately 35.7. I'll round this up to 36. So for this two-year-old, you would have to give him or her a 36 milligram dose. Now I mentioned earlier that when you use this formula, it needs to be in years. Just to give you an idea, in case, let's say your toddler is 20 months. To convert 20 months into years, you need to know the conversion of years to months, and everyone knows that. One year per every 12 months. Now, multiplying this, this unit and this unit will cancel out, leaving you with years. So 20 divided by 12, we can use our calculator really quickly, we end up with 1.6 repeating, or 1.666, where the 6 repeats. So you would use this as your age as opposed to 20 months. And there you have it. Two examples on how to calculate dosage using Young's rule.